today we will learn about associative property of the following mathematical operations with respect to whole numbers we have read that numbers from 0 to infinity are called whole numbers associative property helps us to solve the mathematical operations by grouping the numbers let's understand it in detail Let's talk about the associative property of whole numbers under addition. Let us suppose there are 5 beans, 3 beans and 2 beans. If we want to find out the total number of beans, then which method will we use? We first find their sum, that is, we have to add them. One way to add them is to first make a group of 5 and 3 and add 2 to their sum. Or first We will make a group of 3 and 2 and then add 5 to the resultant sum. No matter how we group the numbers, the result of addition will be the same. In this way, any three whole numbers A, B and C can be added by forming a group of any type. The result of A plus B plus C is equal to A plus B plus C. This will always be the same. Therefore, whole numbers are associative under addition. Now let's understand the associative property of whole numbers under subtraction. Like addition, is subtraction of whole numbers also associative? Think for a while. If we group the numbers in this way, then first we will subtract three from five, and then we will subtract two from the result. Therefore, the answer will be zero. However, if we group the numbers in this way, then the answer will be four. The results in both cases are different. Note: only in this case, subtracting any three whole numbers a, b, c by making different groups result in different results. This means a minus b minus c and a minus b minus c are not equal. that is why whole numbers are not associative under subtraction now let's talk about multiplication look at this picture will you be able to tell the number of tablets by operation of multiplication there are two tablets in each row therefore three rows will have 2 multiplied by 3 tablets and since there are four packets the total number of tablets is 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 4 to solve this A group of 2 and 3 can be made or a group of 3 and 4 can be made. In both cases, the result is 24 tablets only. In this way, any three whole numbers a, b and c can be multiplied by grouping in any order. The result of a into b into c is equal to a into b into c will be the same. Therefore, whole numbers are associative under multiplication. Now if we talk about division then any three whole numbers cannot be divided by changing the order of division that is for whole numbers a b and c a divided by b divided by c and a divided by b divided by c are not equal in this way whole numbers are not associative under division today We have learned addition and multiplication of whole numbers are associative but subtraction and division of whole numbers are not associative in the next video we will see some examples related to this topic